Kawadar is an exclusive variety from West Bengal, file, New Delhi. The West Bengal government is pushing for a ghee tag for the Kawadar mango, arguably the most prized variety among the king of fruits that was created during the reign of Nawab Siraj Ud Dalla strictly for royals only and now sells for up to 1,500 rupees apiece. The precious mango, so delicate that each piece has to be carefully plucked by hand and swathed in cotton, was developed in the late 18th century by the last Nawab of Bengal. The mango was out of bounds for commoners with only royal orchards permitted to grow it and only royals allowed to relish it. Still out of reach for most, except for modern-day royals who have the means to spend, the, the West Bengal government is trying to save and popularize the Murshidabad Nawab's favorite fruit all over the world and get a geographical indication, ghee tag, kawadar is an exclusive variety from West Bengal. It can be only found in Murshidabad. At one time, there were 148 varieties in this district but now only 42 varieties are left. We are trying to save this variety. We have now applied for key tag for Coeder. Hopefully we will get it. Gautam Roy, Deputy Director of Horticulture, Murshidabad told PTI, the Gee tag ensures that only those registered as authorized users are allowed to use the product name. The rare and costly mango is presently on display and sold as a precious item from the state at the ongoing Mango Festival by the West Bengal government in the capital's Janpath area. Legend has that Siraj Ud Dalla, a connoisseur of mangoes, had gathered saplings of the best mangoes from all over the country for his garden in Murshidabad. He had even appointed few of his favorite mango breeders who were treated like Akbar's Navradnas to do research and crossbreed between various mangoes to create new varieties. Coeder was created at that time and it was his favorite, Roy stated. The Coeder is believed to have been created by a royal mango breeder called Haki Maida Mohammadi, by crossbreeding between a mango called Kalopahar and another variety, Roy said. Though the Kalopahar, which got its name from its blackish-green skin, is now extinct, the Coeder continues to grow. But the numbers are dwindling. According to Coeder growers, there are only 10 to 15 growers and only 25 to 30 Coeder trees left in Murshidabad district. Despite the state government's efforts to save the mango species, the district has more than 200 mango orchards but this variety is found only in a few. Some of these trees are over 150 years old. One tree does not bear more than 40 fruits in a season and the trees don't bear fruit every year, making Coeder one of the most sought-after mangoes, said Ashabul Mandol, a mango grower. It is an extremely delicate mango. It is not a very commercially viable mango, he added. But since each mango is priced at more than 500 rupees, growers tend to earn well. Last season we sold each mango at 1,500 rupees per piece in Kolkata, Mandol said. The fruit is so delicate that fully ripe mangoes have to be plucked by hand. They start rotting if they fall from trees or get damaged in handling, it is so delicate that these mangoes need to be packed or kept separately, wrapped in cotton. Legend has it that the Nawabs kept the mangoes dipped in honey to preserve it and increase its shelf life, said Roy. To relish the royal favorite, if you can afford it, eat them the way the royals did. According to legend, Coeder was not sliced by metal knives but bamboo knives to get the real flavor and taste. The Nawabs would then use golden toothpicks to dig in delicately. The Union Commerce Ministry has earlier given the ghee tag for the Ritnagira and Devgad Alfonso mangoes.